Okay, we're doing good. We'll just uh, get up here. Press F to go down. F to go, F to go down. Here we go. So this is the mine. Um, wait, what? What's up guys, my name is Khan and we're back today in Mechanic Miner and as you can see the vehicle has changed a little bit since the last episode. I did a little bit of exploring into that first cave that we went into and uh, I found a bunch of iron and decided, you know what, we need to spruce up the vehicle, put some lights on it, make the whole thing out of iron. This episode, the first thing I want to do, you can see we've got some excess iron here, another 112 or so. And we'll also get some if we recycle some of this. And I want to make a, a sort of rail vehicle. This thing is incredibly uh, fast and bouncy on this piston engine. You can see we're just we're just giving her and yeah, you're you're done. You're done, Scorpio. This thing's got some stupid power too with the two ballistas. But we're gonna run out of space here really quickly. So we've got uh, oh 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 perfect perfect. But uh, we've got, you know, a healing station, a simple storage container, a couple of lights, but we are going to run out of space very quickly in a design like this. And I wanted to make a rail car and extend it out in both directions. And you can see here too, we've got this construct air ventilation system. So when I went deeper into the caves to get iron, I, I ended up coming across this area that wants to kill you. So we can install an air pump. We have iron and all that. But I think the first thing we're going to do is extend this out into a couple of different cars. I want to delete this whole top section because I don't think we need it. I think we can get rid of it and we'll get rid of these lights and uh, we can raise the metal beam up one. I think we'll get rid of this. Don't need that. And we'll just delete all this stuff. But I want to make like a train and have, you know, at least three cars. The central car can provide the power. The two outside cars can. Oh, okay. I, oh, we just picked up everything. Okay. That's fine. But yeah, the two outside cars can provide the, uh, you know, the weaponry and have some extra storage and stuff. But the center car will definitely be where we drive from and, you know, has all the, the good stuff. So we can get rid of these, get rid of this. Uh, these are just wires. So, of course, everything you want connected into the central control system. Uh, mostly when I was playing the game, though, offline, I didn't spend too long in it. Maybe a half hour or so just collecting some iron. I really wanted to have enough resources to start this episode yeah, well, you know, we'll just get rid of everything. Might as well. We'll just completely haul this guy out. Yeah, uh, no, no, get back here. Get back. There's some stuff there. Get, stop rolling. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. It'll sit over there. The other thing I like about this game is it seems like when you recycle stuff, everything's recycled at a 100% recovery rate. So you don't run into issues where you lose material. Like when you mine this, you can see as we take this away, we're getting the iron back for it. So it's really kind of convenient. Um, so this is good. This is a nice flat car. We'll uh, install a motor here real quick. I don't have room for a motor, of course. Inventory is full. Yeah, I figured as much. Uh, I guess we don't need all this rock. Oh boy. Oh boy, that was, that was, uh... I guess when you drop a stack of 100, it makes 100 individual pieces. That just really lagged out the game. Uh... Okay, it's still... It's still spawning rock. Okay, whatever. You know, that's fine. Uh, we'll just leave a mountain of rock there. That's ridiculous. Okay, we need a storage chest again. Let's prioritize here. Let's get a storage chest first. Let's put a storage chest down on this center section. We'll leave it for there for now. Okay, and let's pick up some of this rock. Yeah, just... Oh, there we go. I can actually just click it. That's even better. Okay. Pick, pick up, pick up, pick up. And then we'll use the storage chest. We'll put a bunch of it away. We'll put a bunch of wood away, too, because we don't need that. We're not going to build with wood. We'll put the wood away. Yeah, put the rock away. Put the water away. Can we just pick up this rock, please? No, why are you... Okay, you have to actually... Oh, I see. You have to actually put it in your inventory. This is ridiculous. Okay, there we go. We're going to put an engine down for sure in this center section. I don't know why I deleted that engine. Probably could have just left it. Uh, there we... There we go go okay perfect and we'll get some belts up in here belts connect these to there connect this to the this to there okay so that'll be the power supply let's put two other cars on it first and then we'll worry about getting a boiler and stuff so if you want to have a free floating joint in this game you have to build these coupling pieces so basically what we do is we take the coupling and we put it down like this and then we build another section of coupling like this and we just drag and attach that and now we've got this free floating piece that's connected here and we can connect all sorts of stuff through this we can connect wires through this and pipes through this and all sorts of things so we're gonna have to have one central boiler point and one central wire point and run the wires through 
So, we'll figure that out in a sec. First, we're going to build another car. So, how long is this car is the question. I mean, that's, that's really a good question. Let's make a couple other cars of the same length as this one. So, we'll just really simply just uh, make a line of blocks like this. And take those out. And we'll make another line of blocks. Whoops, that's no good. I'm not very good at this whole click and drag thing. Oh, yeah, no, just disconnect the engine again. That's, that's, that's great, Con. We're, we're doing so good today. Okay, we'll put the engine back on, because, you know, that was important. Okay, engine, put you back here. Belt, you're connected, good, so let's move back over here. There we go, let's finish up these plate lines. Just like that, so that should be one car. That should be another car. Uh, the wheels will be like this. It's a lot easier just to make the, the symmetry if we do it like this, and then we can just delete this. And delete these and we should be able to take this one and just kind of put it over there and this one and just put it over there All right, so this should be the basic rail car setup trees are really annoying But I don't want to get rid of them because oh, uh, you know what? We're just gonna get rid of them There's a, a group of flies Are you serious? I don't have any way of hurting those flies. Oh It's bees. It's bees. I stole honey. Oh, no Oh no, the bees! Okay, we need to we need to build a ballista to shoot the bees with. Oh my goodness, I shouldn't have got rid of all the weapons. Okay, we'll just mount this here. Oh jeebus, that was insane. All right, then we can just simply connect this guy up. So this is easy mode now. We can just take this, put a coupling here. Problem solved. Connect this coupling up to that coupling. Connect like this. Okay, so now these are connected. And then we just need to put some wheels on this guy. Some of these iron wheels. I like the small wheels. There's bigger iron wheels too, but they're just massive. And I don't really see the point of them. Okay, so that's one car. That should be good. Okay, if we, we can get out, you know, we can just do this. Okay, that works. And then we'll just hook up the other one. So we'll put coupling here. Okay, and then we have this three piece in the middle. Of course, it's super dark. Can't see anything, which is just great. It's fine. There we go. Okay, perfect. All right, and then we just need some more wheels on this guy. Sun's coming up too. It's been a, it's going to be a great day. All right, wheel and the other wheel. All right, problem solved. Now we have our beautiful train set up. Should work. These couplings, I, I mean, we could do it with a single hinge point, but with two, then it should be a little bit uh, more flexible when it comes to riding over terrain. It might cause a problem when you try and push it because, you know, we're not we're not pulling it necessarily. We're going to push it in one direction and pull it from the other. But you know what? It should work. should be fine. All right, so we've got our basic train set up now. So all we're going to have to do, we'll just put a really simple copper lever on it here, right in the middle, and then we'll reinforce these. We'll put some doors on it and uh, really try and protect the whole thing. I think for now, we'll just leave these two outside ones as flatbed cars and just kind of have the middle one protected. We'll put some slight walls on the on the outside ones here, so we'll do something like this. Uh, just, you know, like one, two, three, and uh, I think this is the end here, right? Yeah, over here. Okay, uh, okay. One, one, two, why are we rolling? So, oh, we were completely lifting up the middle car, gotcha. There we go. So we'll just make these nice little flatbed cars for now. Have a lot of extra space. And then the middle one will put some doors on it. I feel like if we have the other two sidecars, we should be good. We'll put some ballistas on them as well. So we'll just, uh, you know, I think, yeah, probably pretty close to the end, I guess. Would probably be a good idea. Yeah, you know what? Let's just, we'll put them close for now. We can always put more later. We'll just wire up this way, across. There we go, so that's connected. So now we're moving along, this is great. Perfect. Uh, per uh, um, okay, um, okay, well that is useful. You know what, we need to make this, this middle car heavier. Let's just put all the extra iron on this middle car and uh, make it really the heavy control room and then it should be good to go. So let's put the rest of this plate on it. All right, so hopefully once we've made this middle car heavier, it'll be better. Of course, it's nighttime again, so that's just great, but we'll get some lights on here pretty soon. So let's just go up, build this. Oh, nope, didn't wanna do that. Get rid of that, build this nice box car here. Something like this. 
So hopefully this is a little bit heavier. It'll keep the wheels on the ground. We might need a second set of points to connect this coupling up. So now we should have control over both ballistas, which we do, even though they are on the other cars. You can see there the wires lighting up when we actually use it. Okay, so this is pretty good. Um... Okay, we have a bit of a high centering problem here. Oh, and of course, we need an air ventilation system. Right, right. So let's let's get that going. An air ventilation system. So how do we do that? All right, here we go. So we're going to put the cable back here. We're going to go all the way up with this cable, all the way through the roof. There we go. And then, oh, not going to come down there. We're going to come down here. Like so. We're going to build the extra piece of cable. And we're going to connect this up like this. Okay. So that is objective number one. Cable system is connected. Now we're going to connect the other system. So we need a second pump, which we can put here. We're going to have that on a dedicated on-off switch. All right, this is a mission. This is a mission. Okay, so that turns on the air supply pump, which is kind of weird, but it works. And then we connect that to an air supply system. Air pump, like so. Okay, we use the pipe to connect. Oh, we don't use the pipe. We use the pulley to connect those two together. Starting to get the hang of this. We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, so this connects to this. So now if we turn this on, that activates the air pump. And then the air pump goes to the air vent on our full inventory. We can get rid of that pipe piece. We'll get rid of the rest of this cable. Don't care. And we will put an air vent piece. Okay, now we can finally go back into the line. Is that correct? Are we producing... Does that work? Alright, this train is looking epic. I am... So excited with how this train has turned out. Alright, and then we're just going to connect this guy. Finish this one up with these cables. And finally, we've spent the entire episode building. Which is, you know, it's okay. I don't mind building. If you guys don't want to see me build anything in this game. And you just want to see me adventure. Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, I don't mind building, of course. I thought I would do a little bit of a building episode. Because I did want to make some sort of a train. But if you guys want to see me just do all this building off camera. And explore more in the episodes. We will, of course, do more exploring. This looks like we're, we're set for the future. I mean, we've got we've got everything now. So we've got six ballistas at the ready. That's amazing. We've got some lights. We've got the ability to high center really easily. Uh, that's a bit of a problem. Can we can we can we stop with the high centering? Okay. We're doing good. We'll just uh, get up here. Press F to go down. F to go. F to go down. Here we go. So this is the mine. Um. Wait, what? Are my are my cars stuck? Are you serious? After all that work, you can't build a train. My the the car. Can we can we get them? Can, come on out out of the ground, please. Out of can we not? Can we not? Are you going to pop out of the ground? What is going on? Oh my god. It's like a, a bouncy castle. Okay, can we... Okay, you, you look like you're about ready to come out of the... This is... We might have a problem with the train thing, guys. I don't think... I don't think this game is meant for trains. Um... Okay. This is... This is great. This is... This is great. This is... We spent all that time and all that effort... And we can't even... We can't... What? Uh, well, shoot. I guess we're just gonna have to disconnect the middle section. And we're just gonna have to take it out for a spin. And hope we don't get... Uh, we'll just leave these cars here now for uh, for the time being, I guess. That's... Uh, that's great. We're just gonna... We're just gonna move you over here. Yeah, no, that's... that's this is amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, you know, you know, no, you know, we can't. Oh my goodness, this is, this is turning into quite, quite the endeavor. All right, you know, we're just gonna leave you two there. We're gonna go adventure down into the depths with just this thing. If we can flip it over here, there we go. That is mildly disappointing. I was so excited there. All right, well, this is simple enough. Let's just we'll grab this. We'll put a lamp right up in the middle there. That'll do. And then uh, we'll just jerry rig some, some ballistas here. Seems easy enough. We'll just put one up there. One up there. We've already got the wire right in the top. I can't believe that because the two 
pieces of the rail car, they were uh, sideways on the hill. When you come through the portal, it puts them sideways as well, which is kind of funny. But, um, yeah, there's not really much we can do about that. Okay, we're, we're good here. We got a bat. Go away, bat. All right, let's go down. Let's get down to where these vents are. I'm really, I do want to check out what this material is. This is, we need more lighting here. Let's put some more lights on this. Can't really see much out the front. There we go. And we'll just, uh, can we put this light on the back? Well, that, uh, that was a very pointless endeavor. That was an, uh, awesome excitement. I guess we're going to have to make sure we leave trains on the above ground world. At some point in time, we're going to get to a point where we should build a base. I believe this is it here. Yeah, so there's the poison gas field you can see. And I think if we turn this on now, this is this is what we do, right? Yeah, it looks good. Looks good. It's pushing the gas away from it. Okay. And we can collect whatever this is. Precious metal. Awesome. I don't know what this is. What is this? Manganese. Fantastic. Shoutouts to the devs. I really do love... Oh, boy. No, that's some stuff we got. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. It's hacking through the, it's hacking through the iron. It shot up the whole floor. Hold on, we gotta fix that. Can we repair it? Repair? There we go, there's a repair button. Alright, we need to put the cable back. No, shoot that guy too. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Zoom out. Okay, perfect. Got some tech available, nice. Complete this up, okay. And we'll keep going, look for more manganese. Oh, kill you. Yeah, excellent. But yeah, make sure you guys hit those buttons down below. Let me know what you think in the comments of this game. I still love this game. I think it's fantastic. Uh, lesson learned, though. The train clearly doesn't work, even though it looked fantastic. It's uh, it's clearly not the way to go in this game. Well, before we go, we're just going to get the rest of this manganese in this cave. Uh, we got more guys over here. There we go. Just This double ballista is working great. All right, we're going to... Perfect. Get all this manganese here. Well, I love the train idea still. I still think it's a great idea, and maybe at some point in time we'll we'll revisit it. Obviously, my uh, method of coupling needed a bit of improvement, and of course the uh, the actual fact that you can't bring the train into the mine kind of kind of sucks a little bit, but definitely a lot of fun. Hopefully, maybe when we get back, those those cars will be unhooked and we can just hook them back into this. But either way, we could also build smaller trailers too. Or I guess fold them up. We could like grab them and flip them up before we have to move down. Although that kind of sucks. Takes a little bit of extra time. But all right, we're just cleaning this up real easy. All right, come on, buddy. This thing's really got a lot of kick to it. Definitely a lot of power. Uh, back up a little bit. So I think this is the end of this cave. Make sure, of course, you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below of this game. Let me know what else you'd like me to try and build. Um, the train was definitely definitely a cool idea. Not very practical, but I'm still pretty excited about it. But let me know what you think and uh, make sure you hit those buttons down below. And as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll see y'all next time. I'm going to turn this off now. Perfect. And we're going to make our way out of the cave. <laughs>